I've thought about this through the years plenty of times. And I don't think I've ever talked to anyone about it. Who is the worst NBA player that you could throw on a college basketball team right now and they would win national player of the year? Hmm. Couple boundaries of this. And feel free to ask questions if needed before you give your answer. Boundary number one. He has to be good enough that you put him on any team in the country. He wins national player of the year. So this isn't just like right situation, right fit. I'm talking, you could throw this kid on Northwestern and tomorrow he's the national player of the year. Two, um, we're talking the current version of themselves. We're not talking prime them. We're talking take them out of whoever they are today, throw them in college. They're the national player of the year. What's your answer? So is a, just one last question. We're trying to take the worst NBA player on this, right? Like it's got to be someone who's technically bad NBA player. I mean, as bad as you can go, right? Because like obviously LeBron James, you throw him anywhere. He is what he is. Um, mm-hmm. uh, like Jalen Brunson, throw him anywhere. Probably national player of the year. But from there, it gets dicey. Like, if you took Kyle Kuzma today, is he the national player of the year in college? Yes. Are we sure? Yes, 100%. We're sure? Kuz? Positive, yes. Like, I I know he's a bucket, but like... He's probably averaging 20 and 10, minimum. Kuz isn't that different today than he was five years ago. Yeah, he's he's definitely different. Not that different. Yeah, I guess, but he's averaging 25 and 12, probably. Okay, maybe. Minimum. So I, I think you and I are going to be on different ends of the spectrum with this then. Give me your answer. Oh, my answer, I was going to say Killian Hayes. <laughs> I I don't think Killian would be the national player of the year. You don't think? No. I think I he would pass. He'd lock, he's basically Kolick. I don't think Cole is going to be like, okay. Cause we're talking in this year's college, you got to beat Zach Eady. So you got to beat Eady going for what we expect to be like 24 and 12 on a top four team in the country. What's Killian averaging? You throw him on North. Well, you put Killian Hayes in boo booey's role. What's he averaging? See, I think Kuzma's way too high. Like I'm thinking now that you're bringing that up, like take like Isaiah Stewart, Isaiah Stewart's probably at, could average like what? 25, 25, 15. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, what's your answer? So my historical answer through the years of me thinking about this has been Jordan You're Clarkson. You're an all-star, aren't you? <laughs> Jordan Clarkson has been my answer. Okay. Why Jordan? Just because he's just like a bucket? Like. I don't know. I just I like I envision a world where if you took Jordan Clarkson and plopped him on Utah tomorrow, he scores twenty four a game and has like a Frank Mason National Player of the Year run. I don't. That's all I have. I, I like don't know. The, okay, I like I like the Frank Mason angle. Yeah, but like I don't like Jordan Clarkson to me is a pretty good NBA. Like I don't think NBA bums can just come to college and be that productive individually. Like. Max Christie's in the NBA. You put him in college. Is he the national player of the year tomorrow? No, no. <laughs> he's not. What about what about what about Peyton Pritchard? No, he'd be a first team All American though. Okay, but he wouldn't beat Edie. What about Austin Reeves? Austin Reeves would be national player of the year. Would he? Yeah, I don't think he would. I think he would. I really don't think he would, man. Like, what's Austin Reeves averaging at Oklahoma next year under Porter? 20 something. So he's probably, he's, 20, <laughs> probably 20 something crazy. Honestly, like seven and seven. He's having a buddy healed year. Probably better. Yeah. I think I'll just way off on this then. Like if you, okay. Is Darren Collison the national player of the year? Is Darren Collison still in the NBA? I don't know. But if you no. took him wherever he is. No, I don't think Darren Collison is the national player of the year. Okay. Um, Trying to think of like old guys, like the older guys in the twilight of their career. Does Kevin Love win a national player of the year? I don't know. That's a good one. <laughs> I think he is. No. What about Haslam? What about Blake Griffin? No, he's not. Current Blake is not? 
I think Blake's more likely to get kicked off the team. That dude would be a menace on a college campus right now. That's true. Okay, so d- definitive answer, because I feel like we could just – this is one of those, like, we're together at a party – and like our wives want to like take pictures and play drinking games. And we're like, no, we're going to go. We're, stand we're, we're like, no, if we put Kevin love on Kansas state next year, is he winning national player of the year? Yeah, this is true. Like I, I now want to come hang out with you and just do this for like six hours. What's your definitive answer though, for the podcast sake. For podcast sake, definitive answer. I think I will go Kevin love. I like that pick, actually. I think Kevin Love was the National Player of the Year. I think he put up ed like numbers and be able to shoot the ball, too. Like, he'd be spraying it. He's still a 40% three-point shooter or close to it. Does Sadiq Bey win National Player of the Year? Yes. No, he doesn't. That's crazy, man. I think he does. That's crazy. He might score, like, 28, but that's it. He boards it. Yeah. Okay. Is DeJounte Murray winning national player of the year? Sorry, last one. Last yes, one. Yes, yes, without question. And he's okay. diff, like he's putting up like 35, 15, and 10. Okay. Just, just ask That's him. crazy. That what's Trey Young averaging right now if you drop him back in college? 40. 45 40. and 15. Yeah. Yeah. That's how okay. DeJounte would be close. Okay. I'm sticking with Jordan Clarkson. <laughs> I haven't I haven't heard anything that knocks me off my Jordan Clarkson train. So I don't like that. I mean, I like I don't like that. I, I got no gripes with that. It's a good pick. You mean you don't dislike that then? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I said, I don't like that. I'm like, that was a really nice way to say I don't like that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, 